Hello, my name is Michael Bond, and I'd like to welcome you to Hellworld. Hellworld is a concept for a series of major science fiction action adventure thrillers in the style of Aliens, Riddick, Predator. I'm sure we've all enjoyed stories like that in the past, I'm sure we'd all, we'd all like to see a lot more, but right now there's very little around other than the recent uh, new Riddick film. What I'd like to do is to initiate a whole series of such films. At the moment I've got 15 concepts. Now, a crowdfunding campaign isn't really going to be enough, isn't really going to provide the kind of resources needed to start a whole major series of science fiction films, but it can be the first stage, it can kickstart the process. So what I plan to do for this project is simple. I've got the first concept for Hell World already drawn up. I've got obviously, as I say, about 15 ideas in total. What I plan to do is to turn that first concept into a full feature film script and then convert it into a graphic art novel. That will be a great reward for you, both the script bound and copied to you and a great reward in terms of receiving copies of the graphic art novel. But it's also a great way to demonstrate the real structure and the nature of the story and its potential commercial attraction to investors and film studios in the future. Once we've developed that, I'm hoping that in turn will pull in the money necessary to start the whole process. Not just the producing the films, but I'm also working on ideas for a TV show that might go alongside it, and of course more graphic art novels. The story itself, well, will begin with Hellworld. It's a newly discovered world with a private research consortium that wants to get off quick. So they hire a small family company to come and haul them away. Unfortunately, the ship that's used to transport them off gets into trouble, and the accident leaves them all stranded back on the planet. And they've only got 22 hours left to live, 22 hours to escape. That's the basic story. It's a great introduction, a great thriller, it's a great adventure, and it introduces the basic structure of this world. I don't want to go into too much elaborate detail at this stage. I'd like you to uh, wait and see for yourself. I don't obviously want to give the game away. But the Hell World series has already given to me inspiration for at least 15 other ideas, 15 ideas that will gradually unfold the exploration and evolution of the people and of the world itself and the monstrous danger it poses to the future of mankind if it ever gets loose. As I said, at this stage, we can't do anything major. There's no use trying to launch a film, but we can produce a graphic art novel. So you may say, do I actually have the skills to do at least that? I want to show you something. This is a project that I worked on two years ago called The Little Book of Happiness. I don't know if you can get the light there, but that is a book of political, satirical art. It's British politics, British political jokes. Many people might not get the joke, but that's going to be one of your rewards if you want to support my project. And it demonstrates to you my abilities to work with artists and to turn it into a substantial publication. This I did on my own resources. I didn't use any crowdfunding for that. Um, the next thing you probably want to know is, can I write science fiction? Well, I think the best way for me to demonstrate that is to invite you to go and look at the Hell World pages on my website. And down at the bottom, you'll see a link inviting you to go over and register your details to receive a short science fiction story I wrote a couple of years ago. This is something that I give away free to anyone who's interested. And it's based on the great legendary Lord of the Rings. My idea with Lord of the Rings is what happens if the entire thing is set, not in some ancient mythic past, but somewhere in the far future? What happens if it was a science fiction fantasy? not a mythical one. And then what happens next? What comes after Lord of the Rings? The Dragon World is my interpretation. And maybe one day Dragon's Dale, I was going to say Dragon's Orb, you know. <laughs> Dragon's Dale may one day become another great trilogy of films. But we'll leave that for the future. So, you have the Book of Happiness, and uh, you can learn more about that on its own website, which is bookofhappiness.co.uk. And you can obviously download and receive the Dragon's Dale short story. So that's two samples to show you what I'm capable of doing. What I'm hoping to do with this project is demonstrate my capabilities in terms of the graphic art novel and the film script to the larger film investment community. That way we'll be able to pull all the money in, develop the production centre, establish our own little studio facilities and much, much more. But as I say, we'll keep it at the moment just confined to 
getting the script produced and getting the graphic art novel into production for you. My target initially was to raise about £45,000 for that. I've allowed there obviously with the logistics of printing and distributing all the novels and also working with artists like the guys I work with on this to do all the artwork for the, um, the graphic art novel. But that's only the minimum target. What I'd like to do with your support is to raise a lot more. In fact, it's not just about raising the money, it's also about raising a buzz. The more people feel enthusiastic and prepared to support this, and I think you'll find lots of other reasons to support that if you go through the whole world pages, then the more chance of success in terms of obviously far exceeding the target, raising popular interest and popular publicity, getting the interest of the major film studios when there's a lot of people behind this, let's get a look at it, and of course giving me the resources to do more than just produce a graphic art novel, but establish a more professional production office, establish the entire legal and financial framework behind the idea of the ordinary public as well as you guys are investing in the Hell World series. My ambition is to create something substantial, high quality films with good quality science fiction, not just fantasy films or, or a hobby house or monsters in the, uh, the stories of the whole or whatever type stories. So it's going to go, I hope, far beyond what we've seen with films like Predator or Alien and explore more science fiction themes, but in a way a broad audience can, en can uh, enjoy and understand. That's the gist of the Hell World project. I could say a lot more, but we'll keep it nice and tidy for now. And if you do want to know more, let me know. There's a link on the Hell World pages at my website, which is morefilms.com. You can use that specific link for any questions, or I'll try to answer them on Facebook or on Twitter. You can find all those details also on the Hell World pages. So, come and join me. If nothing else, spread the word. Tell all your family, tell your friends, tell your own social network of your science fiction enthusiasts. Everyone you know, spread the word far and wide, and let's welcome everyone to Hellboy.